Yeah, good morning, Dominique Bisky. The party planning process has already begun, but they're needing just a little bit of help from the community, and that's where you can play a part. This morning, I'm joined here by Vanessa Brown, the executive director of this location. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. How are you doing? I'm doing good. So tell us about the Christmas party that you have coming up. So next Thursday, we're planning our annual Christmas party for our kids that we serve here in Cattle and Bolshe Parish. And we're super excited just to be able to bring Christmas home to them because a lot of our kids that we serve may not be able to see Santa Claus, celebrate with family. So we're able to bring everything that they need here for the youth who need us most. What are you asking from the community to help contribute to this party? So what we're needing is new or gently used gifts because we will be redistributing those gifts next Thursday. But just with so much support from the community this year, we've been able to be super successful. So we're hoping not only for our Christmas party next Thursday, but as we're going into the new year, individuals will continue to support our great mission. How many children do you normally serve at this location? So we serve kids um, completed kindergarten all the way to 12th grade. We have over 100 kids enrolled, but of course a lot of our kids are walkers. So the weather may have some, um, some situations and some things that kind of go with that. But we're serving about 65 to 70 kids daily. Um, can you just talk about some of the good things that you've done at the Boys and Girls Club here over the past year? Yeah, so this year we focused more on trauma. So coming out of COVID for a lot of our kids, we're starting to be able to identify what that trauma looks like. And our goal is to be able to help them not only be successful here within our facility, but outside in the real world as um, they become young adults. Thank you so You're much. Welcome. And like she said, they are accepting donations before ahead of the Christmas party next Thursday, reporting live here in Shreveport, Epiphany Lachey, KSLA News 12.